In this video, you will see how China has participated in investing and partnering with other countries in building mega projects. Hi, good day to everyone, Arthur here. And of course, Richard Aguilar here, and now we are back again with another amazing video for today. But before we proceed, be sure to subscribe and push the bell icon so that you will always be updated with our new videos. China now is participating in infrastructure investment in the world. This country has helped, funded, and supported other countries when it comes to building infrastructures. As a result, many countries are benefiting from China's ongoing mega infrastructures being built on the other countries. And now, today in this video, brace yourself to see 8 examples of how China has participated in infrastructure investment in the world. And since I don't want to waste your time, let's jump into our number 1. Number 1 is Brazil's privatization of infrastructure with Chinese investment. Brazil and China agreed to strengthen exchange and cooperation efforts in several fields and facilitate trade according to Brazilian Vice President Hamilton Mourão. And now, Chinese state enterprises are playing an increasingly important role in Brazil's infrastructure, in some cases controlling companies previously owned by the Brazilian government. Number two is China and Brazil work hand-in-hand -hand on new energy project. Chinese companies were already a powerhouse in Brazil's energy sector, owning about 10% of the country's capacity mostly because of big acquisitions in recent years by State Grid and China Three Gorges, not to mention the thousands of kilometers of transmission lines being built. And here is another one of how China has supported Brazil. A Chinese company is partnering with the people of Brazil to make sure they have enough energy for their daily needs. Number three is China shares a future of clean energy with the world. From wind farm in Ethiopia, hydropower station in Pakistan, to nuclear plant in Britain, China is dedicated to sharing a future of clean energy with the world. Number 4 is Chinese Belt Motorway employs many in Pakistan.
aerial view of Chinese built Sakra Mountain Motorway in Pakistan, the largest transportation infrastructure project under the China Pakistan Economic Corridor. Number five is Portugal's green energy sector shines after Chinese investment. Portugal has become a beacon for green energy. Last year, the country managed to run for four and a half days on renewable energy alone. Number six is trade and investment behind China's international infrastructure building. Many of today's Chinese companies are not only active in engaging in the overseas market, some are now building business infrastructures that allow other Chinese firms to thrive in foreign markets. Number seven is major Chinese built projects in Africa. China is presently involved in infrastructure projects in more than 30 African countries. A concentration of projects to be found in Angola, Nigeria, and the Sudan. And now, this is how China is fueling economic growth in African nations. Here's a brief look at Chinese built projects in Africa. Number eight is China to construct major motorway in Senegal.
Senegal has commissioned the construction of the country's largest road projects since independence in 1960. The contract was awarded to a Chinese company that expressed confidence that construction of the Isla Tuba Highway should be completed in under four years. That's all for now. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Now, if you have something to say about this video, please leave your comment below. Once again, this is Arthur. And I am Richard Aguilar. Thanks for watching and see you on the next video.